let's look here. There he is. Look at one, two, and then Bing in front. Look at who's standing there. Keith Acton, number 12, allows Troche the freedom in front of goaltender Wamsley, and Brian Troche rips it past him right here. Bang. One quick move. Puck kicked out from behind the net. John Tonelli fighting off Robinson and getting the puck to Troche. He took the shot. Trotsky, I think, got a piece of it. It's two to nothing. Islanders, a power play goal at 15-31. Dennis Potvin to Bossy. Look at the hard shot stopped by Wamsley. There's the rebound. John Tonelli and Brian Trotsky both poke at it, but it's John Tonelli. There's a bird's eye view of the power play of the New York Islanders. There's the pass. Potvin to Bossy. His quick shot, and John Tonelli puts the rebound in. Number 27 for Montreal, Gilbert Delorme. Cat screen. He went off at 8.38. Bourne scores at 8.42. Right from the faceoff. There's Bourne. He gets the puck back. A backhand shot into the lower right-hand corner. Beats Walmsley. Caller raises his arms. Let's look again. There's Bourne as he gets the puck from the faceoff and puts it in the lower right-hand corner and ties the hockey game. Bob Bourne scoring. That's his 10th goal of the season. A backhand shot, a power play goal. And the Islanders tie the game at three. A happy hockey player. Montreal had possession of the puck. Lafleur couldn't hang on to it. The Islanders take it away. There's Gillies miscuing on a chance. Get the stick on the puck, but Matseline fights a rolling, bouncing puck, and then a backhand shot. Looked like he could have got a little help from Bourne. Let's look again. There's Bourne to Gillies. Missed on the shot. Robert Picard, number 24, tried to cover him. Root tries to get after Matt Celine, but he beats Walmsley with another backhand shot. And the Islanders.